Looking relaxed as he breezed past reporters, Rod Blagojevich returned to court Tuesday to plead not guilty on federal corruption charges. The government is accusing the former Illinois governor of trying to sell the Senate seat vacated by now President Barack Obama, among other charges. Blagojevich has been the focus of national attention since his December arrest. I'm glad this process has finally begun. Uh, it's the end of the beginning in one respect, but it's the beginning of another uh, aspect, and that is the beginning of me being able to prove my innocence and clear my name and be vindicated of what are inaccurate allegations. Blagojevich's <laughs> <laughs> well, arraignment created a media swarm outside the federal court building in downtown Chicago. The former governor has not been shy about talking to the media. He recently hosted a morning radio talk show in Chicago. I have great respect for the court process, and I'm not going to try this case with all due respect in front of you guys. I'm going to respect the court, but uh, I'm innocent of every allegation. I look forward to letting the truth win out and, uh, and being vindicated in the process. And, I, and let me say one more thing. I want to say this to the people of Illinois. I have not let them down. I never stopped working hard for them and fighting for them. I haven't let them down. The Fed's evidence against Blagojevich include recorded phone calls. The former governor has maintained his innocence throughout this process. Blagojevich's brother, who is also accused in this scheme, pled not guilty on Tuesday. Mark Carlson, The Associated Press, Chicago.